Uh, hey, what's going on everybody? It's your friend Neighborhood Father here and today well, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a three-story elevator within Minecraft. So just sit back, relax, and let's get into the tutorial. Alright, so this is the elevator itself. It's pretty simple. I'm just going to show you guys how it works before um, we get into the how to make it. So you just stand on the slime block, which will be your elevator. Hit the button, go up all the way to the third floor, get back into the single block. And then hit the button again. Oh wait, you're supposed to go down to the second floor, but I guess I went too fast. So you hit it, third floor. See, now I'm on the second floor, and then you hit it one more time to get back onto the first floor. So anyways, I'm just going to show you guys the redstone behind it real quick. Show you how simple this build really is. There's not that much to it. You do not have to be, oh, that frame rate. You do not have to be a redstone expert or an engineer or mechanic, whatever you want to call yourself, to do this. So yeah guys, next time I see you, I will be having all the materials to make such a thing. Alright guys, so to make this stuff, this is the redstone things you need. You need a redstone repeater, some redstone, redstone block, redstone torch, any slab would work, a button, doesn't matter wooden or stone button, a sticky piston, and a non-sticky block. So that's either going to be a furnace, a chest, or a note block. And the slime block, of course, to elevate you up. You're going to need a few decoration blocks if you want to look good. Um, you're also going to need a, either like some kind of block or some sort to, keep, to make sure you're in the single block to, for the elevator to work. And I'm going to be using this polished granite as my um, you know, redstone thing so you see where everything's going. So yeah guys, next time you'll see me, we'll be making the first steps to this new elevator. Alright guys, I just got finished making the structure. I just basically replicated that one. Just looks kind of duller. So anyways, we're going to get into the very first part of this, which is going to be very simple. The elevator that you're going to be making is in the middle of these two pillar things. It's the odd one out. So you're going to stand here and you're going to go two to the right. So that's one block, two block. And right there is where you're going to place your first button and then it's just the same thing for the next two levels and before I forget guys this elevator only works with a two block high ceiling it won't work with three blocks so make sure it's two blocks before you go mess everything up and I have to restart because I know the struggles of that guys so anyways that's the first part of it the second part is we're basically done with the, with the button right now the second part is you come down hit a block make sure you're two blocks deep so one, two, two blocks deep, and then you just come down here, place down a sticky piston, and then a slime block, and you want to put down um, some unsticky blocks, so that you could either put down a furnace, a chest, or a note block, whichever you prefer. I think the note blocks look a lot more stylish, in my opinion, I don't know about you guys. So I'm just going to put these note blocks down so they don't stick. I right, just get rid of that, that, and that. Okay, so that's that part. And then we're about to get into the first redstone side of things. So you want to come up to your third button, which is right here on the third floor. And right behind that button, you want to get your redstone torch, place it there. And then right underneath it, you want to place two blocks. It doesn't really matter. Just take out the first one, put a redstone torch on it, and put a redstone dust on top of that. And after that, you come down I would think whereas one block down they come one block down and place an upside down sticky piston and then a redstone block underneath that then you skip to so you should be down here at the last block and just put three blocks down and fill it all up with some redstone boys alright so now you got that redstone stuff that's the very first beginning of this tour of Minecraft and stuff. So the next part, you want to come down to the piston that you place down in the very beginning. You want to make a little staircase. So that's one. That's two. Get rid of that. This is three. So bam, bam, bam. One, two, three. And then right above the redstone, you want to place another block. And then, oopsies. And you want to place another block right next to it. And on this block right here, you're going to be putting down your redstone repeater and keeping it on three ticks. And then after that, you get a redstone torch, place it down, place 
a block over that. Wait, actually no guys, I forgot to do something. I forgot to add in the sticky pistons. What a new move. But it's no, it's no harm, no foul. We all got this down, boys. So, yeah, there's gonna be one right here. And there's gonna be another one right about there. So you wanna come over here, hit it, hit it, hit it. Hit that one more time. Place this in. You want to put your sticky piston in there and the block that you're using as a floor in there too and then just cover this back up because when this uh, when the sticky piston activates it's going to cover that hole so there's no need to fear about that one and then you come and do the same thing up here that actually belongs right there and um, you just do the same thing put the sticky piston in, put uh, whatever you're using for your floor and then it should do the same thing whenever the sticky piston is activated it should cover that hole Alright, now that we're back in business and I had that minor whoopsies mistake. So you're going to take that block out, um, take that block out, take that block out, put a redstone torch above that, what we just did here. And then you're one going to, you're probably, you're basically going to be doing the same thing. Place another block right there. You place a red, no, no, you don't place a redstone repeater. Um, Hold on guys, I, for, I forgot what it was. Let me just take a look over here, right? Okay, so redstone, torch. Oh, alrighty, alrighty. I see what's going on here. I forgot about this, guys. It's, it's been a while. It's been a while. So then after that, you, this block isn't, is it necessary? No, I don't think so. So you go like that, place some more redstone dust, and this is when your slab comes in try to keep it the same color as the granite you place one on top of there and then you place that down opens it up and this this is the final part guys but this is also the most crucial part if you don't get this right then it will not work so you get a sticky piston you place it upwards right next to the repeater place a block on it and then you connect it to that and then just hit the redstone Feel like okay yeah that doesn't need to be there I, I felt like it did I don't know why all right so this should be the moment of truth and there you go boys you got yourself a working elevator but just in my opinion some things you could add um, maybe like a uh, a furnace or something oh dang it you could add a furnace so you know it ensures that you're gonna be staying here so uh, should I? No, I'm just, I'm not, I was gonna add a, um, a, f a wooden fence, a door fence. So you come all the way up. Wait, does the um, does the third floor not work? Yeah, the third floor didn't work. Well, why is that? I'm confused. All right, guys. So I'll be back in a second when I figure this. Well, it does work. Wait, did I? That's at three ticks. Okay, hold on. Let's try this one more time, guys. So this should work if everything's done correct. There you go, third floor. So yeah, that's that, guys. And actually, if you guys just want to make a two, a uh, two-door elevator, then you could just. Oh, I think this might work. If you just want it to be two floors instead of three, just go like that. And then there you go. That's it. See, you're on the second floor, so it doesn't need to be three three stories if you don't want it to be. But that's how you make a three-story elevator. And I'm actually going to make it daytime. And yeah. So if you want to add some decorations on here to make it look good, you know, like how I did with the wooden fences and the glass plane panes, then you can just go ahead and do so yourself, guys. But, you know, that's been another video. Hope you guys did enjoy it. Like I did say, this redstone was very simple. If you guys want to see more redstone builds or something like that, so let me know in the comments, guys, and I'll be sure to make more videos. Hope you guys have enjoyed. Sorry for the uploads. I'm, I've been grounded lately. So, yeah, um, if you like, if you want to see more stuff, subscribe if you're new to the family, and I'll catch you guys later. Thanks for watching. Bye, y'all.